All right, so we're in the grotto. Sorry. Um, the, uh, the, oh, I'm not going to be able to say this. The My Queened Colony? My Conid Colony? My Conid? Okay, yeah, I can't pronounce anything. Anyway, we're in the other dark, and I'm going to now talk to this hobgoblin here. Blurg. <coughs> ah, a visitor. You're a welcome sight. But let us observe the customs of the locals. The scholar's brow tenses. His voice spills into your skull, the spores connecting mind to mind. Blurg. Proud member of the Society of Brilliance at your service. <laughs> Perhaps not. Mm, your mind is far more complex than that of the fungi. Understandable. We are small in number and rarely stay in one place for long. My colleagues and I are working to improve conditions in the Underdark. This need not be such a dire, hostile place. Our kind has suffered needlessly for generations. Do you also seek peace among the Myconids? Myconids. So, so the My Myconid colony. Okay. Thanks, dude, for, for correcting me on my pronunciation of the colony that I'm currently standing in. Okay. Okay. I know the feeling well. What has driven you from home? Um, sure. I'm, I'm feeling very TMI right now. You were infected by an illithid tadpole? Sure, It's yes. a miracle you're still intact. Yep. You must be worried sick, but have no fear. I have a friend who may be able to assist. Omelium! I hope this is important, Zerg. My Zerkwood samples need constant attention. It is. This adventurer has an illithid tadpole inside her head, but she hasn't turned. No ceramorphosis? That's impossible, but intriguing. Are you looking to have it extracted? Yes. Gaeh, your head will make a fine trophy for my queen. Please hold. I understand your rage against my kin. My species has terrorized the Underdark for countless generations. But I assure you, I stand with the Society of Brilliance, not the colonies of my people. Fool! They infest your head and invade your dreams, and still you would parley! I ask only that you refrain from violence. I respect that your opinion of my kind may be... charged. If that settles matters for the time being, would you like a diagnosis? Open your mind to me. Let us see what lurks within. Okay, Liara. I mean, okay. <laughs> sure. As the Meloon's mind pierces yours, the tadpole pulses with power. It feels ten times its size. Alive. Awake. Almost smug. This is most unusual. The incubation period should be complete, as should your transformation. But the lava is infused with strange magic. It appears to be in some form of stasis. No. It appears to be shielded from physical and magical influence. And even without the shield, the extraction would involve severe cranial trauma. Okay. 
Okay. It is not ideal. <laughs> no shit. The process would surely kill you. But not to worry. Should you transform, I will happily perform a new examination. Oh, well, thank you. A Nautiloi? Fascinating. I have never set foot on a one million? myself. They were our warships during the greatest eras of the Illithid Empire. We ruled the entire astral plane from their decks. The design was lost when the Gith rebelled and ended our dominion. Okay, I gotta turn down the ambiance, music, whatever, after this. Of course. I am sorry I cannot assist you in its removal. But I have an idea. Oh, perhaps I should start taking notes. There may be a way to bypass that stasis. There are many alchemical substances that can influence the mind. I do not intend to shatter its protection. I need only bypass the interference that prevents me from communicating with the lava. Hmm. A tincture distilled from a collection of rare mushrooms. They have subtle psionic influence. I would require a fresh tongue of madness and timusk spores. But be warned, in their natural state, both of these mushrooms can be quite dangerous. Timusks cause confusion in those that approach them. The tongue is self-explanatory. Yeah, when he talks about the tongue, I just think of this tongue running around amok, going amok, 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 amok. <laughs> Sorry. Um. My formula will hamper the more harmful effects once the mushrooms are brewed into a potion. Your sanity, however much you possess, should remain intact. Should. The Underdark, of course, although they are quite rare, and their discovery perilous. Hmm. I imagine Lenore would have them in her possession. She served Mistra as a cleric. The Southwest, when I last saw her, although. Her tower does have a tendency to move. And some gnarly ass fucking traps, too. Oh, excuse my language. May your travels be safe and swift. Okay. Alright, what do you have to eat? What do you have to Welcome sell? Welcome back. Yes. Have you made any new discoveries? No, I just want to look at your, your, your stuff that you have for uh oh yeah ha huh. let's be rude it's true that many of my brethren are enslaved here but my intellect has secured my freedom it is my hope that my research will lead to liberation and peace for my people such designs are part of why i've devoted myself to studying the myconids okay i do enjoy a good bargain if anything in my private collection is to your liking. Yeah, what do you have? Oof. See here, we got some boots. Derp. Very well. I have mushrooms to catalogue. Okay. How is your more mm, personal research progressing? Not it's in the pouch. Well. The nutritional species receives from other mines. <laughs> 
Oh shit. Okay. Yes, let's get out of that. Jesus, guys. Can't take you anywhere. Watch this. One acorn truffle is green or yeah, white. Okay. Oh, I'm supposed to talk to what's his face? Isn't he up here? Oh. That sovereign? Yeah. <sighs> Damn it! Oh, don't. Her condition is familiar. Poison, derived from a wild weed common to the Underdark. She'll need an antidote soon, most likely held by the Poisoner. <laughs> I can end your suffering if you want. Wow. Dwego! Slashed me! Oh. <sighs> <sighs> Raise. Don't share. Talking hurts. Leave me. Please. Okay. Like dwarves, Dwergar have innate resistance to poison, and thus no need for intricate brews. Though deadly if left untreated, the poison can be cured by the antidote or natural remedies. Do I have one? Evidently I do, maybe. Maybe? Yay, I'm a nice drow. Ah, God! Whatever that is, I needed it. Why are you helping me? You're a drow. Well, just because I'm a drow doesn't mean, you know... Now I know. I thank you for your help, but I've got to get moving. Oh, it hurts. Carl's garters. Oh, I don't have time for this. My kin need me. Maybe not, but you are. I need you to rescue my kin. Okay. We can pay. We're Einhan Clan, best artificers in Baldur's Gate. We were on an expedition down here when the Dwergar snatched us up. I got away, but not the others. The Greys have them digging out some old ruin across the lake. Hmm. Just mining for materials. Nothing unusual. But our work pays well. Help my clan, and we'll make it worth your while. I hmm. swear. So my insight fails. So there's something going on there. Thank you. Only wish I could go with you. But here. I nabbed these boots from the Greys when I ran. I'll feel better knowing you're using them to kick some Dwerger ass. Yeah. I'll mark where I made my escape and uh, wait here, I suppose. Not much choice, eh? See what these boots are. Oh. Boots of speed. So it gives you dash. Hmm. 
I don't think I need it. Dash. I mean, I guess I could if I needed to get up high. I'm not gonna really hit much webs down here. We'll see. The sovereign's thick fingers stroke the corpse at its feet. A droning melody greets you as the creature turns its gaze to you. Flesh talker, I show you a memory. Watch and listen. A violent vision grips you. Dwega, dark dwarves chopping myconid remains. They broke our peace. They killed our young. The Sovereign's song slows to the pace of a dirge. It is still in mourning. We laid waste to many, but intruders remain. Lakewood. The Sovereign's song halts as it measures your worth. I sense your resolve. You will find Dwergar invaders near Lake's Edge. Cleanse the rot. Destroy them. I admit, I like this one's approach. A little genocidal, but effective. Right? I mean, killer mushrooms. <laughs> ah, ha, ha. Yes, our enemy's flesh makes a fine host for my growing children. If I die down here, destroy my corpse. <laughs> Don't worry. I wouldn't hesitate. <laughs> Dude, Jesus Christ. Reminds me of, like, what, Miranda and Jack from from Mass Effect 2. Jesus. You may not... The spores hear only the circle. They dance to no other harmony. Deep purples swirl into familiar shapes. Gnomes in mining gear chased by Dwegar. The Dwegar seek a gnome. It is a guest. Okay. Okay, I'll be the vicious. The Sovereign gifts you one more vision. A wall of vines parting to reveal glowing light. Treasure. Riches of magic and mind. Cleanse the rot, and they are yours. You do the circle a service. We will await word. Okay. Oh, okay, I see what he's doing. He's turning the Dwergar into his little babies. <laughs> had it, didn't I? Whatever. A drow? Play nice, or these shrooms will be on you in a flash. Now, doubt you'd care to notice, but you didn't see a dwarf on your travels, did you? Balin's his name. So you insult me, and then you ask me if I've seen somebody. Okay. Or you assume of me doing something.
Right. Never mind. My useless husband. Sent him for an errand. It's no surprise he's made a mess of it. <laughs> Bald, blue tunic, dumb as a stick. money figures okay I'll try I'll have to try and remember that remember remember all right anyway it might be enough to cover rent want master back he treats me good now doesn't kick me anymore okay Flesh walker. Oh, okay. Tongue talker. You hail from the dark. Yet far you've come. Reach into memory. Tell me of home. Okay. It reveals its own home in reply. A humid cove filled with decaying myconid corpses. I can I gotta remember that. Destroyed my people. I am a sovereign with no circle. This circle does not welcome me. But I have heard the song. You mean to cleanse the Dwergar rot. I mean to join you. Um... In death, your foe becomes your ally. I will raise it. You may command it. Okay, so he raises the dead. <clears throat> so I know that if you accept his help, that if you leave the Underdark, you lose him because he won't, he won't follow you up top. But I believe you can recall him when you come back down. I, I think you can either come back and talk to him and, and join him back up or or call out to him through the spores. I can't remember. That was early access too, so I don't know. So, I mean, I don't plan going up top. Maybe. Unless the camp. I don't know. Very well. Remain in the Underdark, and I will follow. We cleanse the rot together. Okay. Okay, so I saved and reloaded my game. Alright, so my HUD is back now. Woot! <laughs> that was a little, uh, disconcerting. Stool. I'm gonna go this way, I guess, to over here, and then come back down and around and come back, I guess. Don't mind if I do. What pots can I make? No, not lithic powers. So what is that? Manage, manage experiences. Okay, experiences none. 
Oh, but I have three worms in my brain, though. Oh. Three new recipes. Oh, so I can make all that stuff. Diluted oil of sharpness. Hmm. Oh, I can make a couple of them. Malice. What does it do, though? I wonder what that does. Ooh, I can make grenades. Web grenades or alchemist fire. Okay, I like that. Sets crap on fire. Okay, I got a home brewer achievement, it looks like. Okay, that does the one slot. I think so. Oh. How many more uh, spell slots does it give you? Elixir of the Colossus. Oh, so does it make you stronger? all that stuff. Okay, what are some of these? Okay, gives you an additional level 2 spell slot. Okay. Okay. I like that. Malice. Coat your active weapon with poison. Targets must succeed constitution saving throw or become blinded and poisoned. Oh, well. Let's give that to Astarian. Hey, he's got a whole bunch of stuff in here. What the hell? Send that to camp. Those can all be sold. Okay. Alright. Oh, my tablet keeps chirping. What does the deep hole do? Even with your keen eyesight, the hole below you soon plummets into an abyss of impossible darkness. Faint sounds echo against unseen stone, nothing discernible by eye or ear. <laughs> I'm not gonna yell hello down the hole. Yeah, okay. Very well. Odd markings. Recent from the looks of it. Okay. that burns within is fading. The magic in your fingers sparks, but your spells fail again and again, consumed by the Sousa flower. You look drained, and I know it wasn't me. <laughs> is the plant bothering you? Might I suggest getting it back? I don't travel with you for your personality, you know. Oh, thanks. Wow. It took your power and your sense of humor. How wretched. 
Let's finish up here quickly. The sooner we can get your magic back, the safer we'll be. Until then, try not to die. Okay. So... They're in with range... Okay, so it has to be within range of me. So... Okay, so they're next to me. So nobody can carry this? Oof. What if I put it in a bag? Will that... Cause it to... Nope. So I need it to make... Okay, so if I have it... Give it... Oh wait, where'd it go? Oh yeah, I put it in the pouch. So if I give it to Lazelle and stay away from her, I get my magic back. Okay. So in fights, I just have to make sure I'm not standing next to Lazelle to be able to cast stuff. Fun. Okay. Oh, what's down there moving? go make the weapon okay stay back there Lizelle oh that's right I don't want to hurt him where's his backpack Stop! Stop! Bibberbang! He's indeed surrounded by Bibberbang. But right? The spores of those mushrooms are both toxic and flammable. I know that! <laughs> Scroll! Escape! My bag! Please! I've dropped it! Somewhere! Thank you. Thank you. Okay. F5 this because I'm going to screw this up somehow. No, no. Bad idea. Alright, so there's his backpack. Alright. It's gotta be! Oh, wait. I don't want to take it. I what want to. What are you doing? Get out of there! Throw it. Throw... As, uh, what were you saying? <laughs> um... I was looking for... Dereth. She's... She'll be worried sick. I must... Need to go. For you. Your trouble. Invisibility. All right. Okay, let's let's walk back a little bit. 
Out of the fire. <laughs> All right, so we'll stand here and wait for the fire to to relax. All right, let's go walking around in the ash. Okay, there's a torch. Nothing. Ignis! At the ready. But I fail. Oh, there's some candles. Oh, yeah, I'm supposed to connect back to you guys. I'll take some candles. Okay, is this... I'm trying to figure out if I can go up. No. Something over there. I thought so. trying to click on this stuff sometimes. I don't want the torch. Enough waiting. I crave blood. I know you do. Oh, I think this is a way to get around the area. I don't think it necessarily goes up. There is an area down here that you can go up. Still breathing, despite everything. Moving in. Okay. those creatures I'm gonna go back to the myconid wish I had a bag of holding I think that's what they're called the myconid village oh well whatever I'll get those when I come back out I knew I was forgetting something what sorry love absolutely worthless she's awesome How long have you been down here Think, Balin, think. My friend, Bibberbank. Curious, beautiful, but dangerous. Next time, more careful next time, for certain. Thank you for your help. Okay. I. I think I. Uh. uh anyway. What were you saying? He's a little forgetful now, isn't he? My, um... My words get away from me. You'll have to ask Derith. She knows the ins and outs. Okay. The shop! The shop needs all we find. Bone cloaks. Baldur's Gate. Anything from... Anything sourced here. Very high rate of profit. Okay. Noble stock. Yes. There it needs noble stock. Mushroom. Good stuff. A and the ledge. Yes. 
I was on a ledge. Crumbled to bits. And I tumbled down. Mushroom. Powerful. Did it wants it for a brew. She's very good, my dear it. Very good at a brew. Okay. Meanwhile, I need stuff from a star in. I want to talk to her. Look at that. Got my useless old man back. I suppose that's your doing. His hands are empty as a whole. We'll have to send him back out soon enough. Love. <laughs> Never heard of it. <laughs> Aelin's meek now, but he used to be a rotten old bastard. Treated me like an old shoe for 70 years. Losing his mind was the only good he ever did by me. Please, Balin's got a job to do. We can leave when he's done it. Okay, well. 70 years of terror. For what? Improvised attacks made with improvised weapons. So improvised weapons. So is that like throwing a gnome into a into a goblin? Haha. <laughs> -ha. Okay. How long have you been down here? Master is back. Good. Missed him. Okay, anyway, so I need to go that old idiot to Right. Oh crap. What was that? Oh. I think I took it to the camp and put it in camp. Cuz it was the course, blueprint was to make back. Oh, it's, it's withered? Surface air, so what the hell? Oh, because I picked up the flower, not the actual bark. Okay, so yeah, delete this whole entire fucking shit. Okay, so back to the mind of colony. Alright. So yeah, so I didn't get the bark, I just got a flower, so... Alright, so back to... Down here, oh wait, am I supposed to get... What's his face again? On my way. Where is he? Nope, okay, he's this way. Oh, he's not there. So Why where is he? I go myself? Wait, did I get something to call him? Why do I have a severed arm? That's just gross. Oh, okay, he's right there. 70 years of terror. For what? Alright, so I'm not gonna get him yet, because I'm gonna go fight. Though he might be. Think, Balin, think. It is time. We take death to the Dwegar. 
Fine, let's just go kill the Dwegar, I guess. And get it over with. <clears throat> or maybe. No, we'll go back this way and get this to support. Yeah, it's over in here somewhere. Then you gotta go into the tree and get it. Uh oh. I knew he was gonna see us. Sarian. over the edge either. resistance. Okay. Multi-attack. Okay. <sighs> it's blind anyway. Kind of like blind sight. Really? I only have one spell slot? Weird, I thought I was all saved up, but I guess not. Okay, um... It's in poison. Okay, so I don't want to get too close to an edge. That's the problem. Because I don't want to get... Heading there. Knock the hell back, because... Yeah, these guys will launch you, I think. Well, yeah, that's right. She's got an extra attack. Figures. Two more attacks, it'll finally get there. Ooh, what is this? Multi attack. Okay. Sun sickness. Is it because I took him out in the sun? What? Huh. Okay. Let's get 
There's another one around somewhere. Time to press ahead. I thought. Okay, Starian, I need you. I think it's up here. up in the tree okay oh it's up here so you gotta go up here that's a bloom but the bark is up here somewhere I think there it is okay all right down I guess I fight it down here do anything, but I guess I can get him down. I guess I could have dashed. Okay, come down. And he doesn't get to go prone. It's been a long day. Better stop to rest soon. Oh, there's another one down there. Okay. So I know where to get him from. Oh, saw us. to go down there? Okay, I can stay up here. Suit. 
up. Okay, calling in reinforcements. How many more are down there? I've already killed two. Oh, there's another one there. Okay. the blighted village no no i feel the fair's rest fading i cannot leave the underdark i know you feel it too the underdark's magical energy the fair's rest slipping from your grasp ah uh. Well, I guess I can continue on. Jesus. Fine. I'm going to end the video here for today. Please like this video if you liked it. And if you made it this far, subscribe. Bye.